so far so good. Just two rods this morning, so no tangles. Perfect. All right, Friday morning. Gorgeous morning out here. Oh, I'd normally be getting ready for work, heading off to a day of teaching, but taking the Fridays off has been the best thing I could have ever done. Just needed a break. Two years working in an indigenous community and then coming back to a busy Gold Coast school. It's just five days was a bit much. Then with my own young kids as well. So yeah, it's been good. Uh, 6.30 in the morning. Heading out to the Pinnacle, got a couple of slimies out. Um, yeah, just waiting for those reels to go off. There's no boats out here, it's right on low tide, so they couldn't get out uh, through the bar. But a couple of kayakers, um, they're over on the end edge of the main reef there. Apparently some bust ups, uh, long tail are floating around. So, you never know, one of these reels might start screaming. Haven't caught a long in a while. I'd love to do a longy with Gail Taku. I'd love to do so many fish with Gail Taku, like my last video. Uh, longy would be awesome. Barra would be sick. I'm going to see my brother in Weeper in about a week's time. So that will be really good. I'll get some Barra for sure. He's been catching just off the bank. He's been getting like 10, 10 Barra a session. Not big ones, but occasionally up to that 60, 70 centimetre range. So that'll be a fun trip. Ah, uh, yeah, Just heading out to the pinnacle and hopefully get something on the way. Okay, fish on. Feels a bit jumpy. Could be a tuna. I think it's a tuna. I'll get my legs in after that footage of Dan. Oh, come on. Whatever it is, it's smashed. Absolutely smash that slimy. Oh, see any colour yet? Oh, yep, see a little bit of colour now. Is it long, I think? Is it? That's oh, a match, you know. much coming up to the pinnacles now probably another 100 meters 200 meters in front of me so that tuna took me uh yeah like 500 meters south so just work my way back uh, 30 meters of water comes up to 15 and I'll just go right over the top of it hopefully there's heaps of bait sitting around there and if there's bait there's fish I'd love a wahoo at the moment that's what I want to catch more than anything really pretty much a big wahoos marlins up there of course and a big jewel as well they're the, they're the trifecta if I can get all three of those this year 
I'll be pumped. Even one of them, I'll be stoked. That wind is just picked up from nowhere, so I would hate to. That wind has just picked up from nowhere, so I'm gonna do one more pass over the pinnacle here and then start heading back. I'd hate to grab a, I'll hook up to a big 30 kg long tail or something and end up in bloody New Zealand. So, baits are out and we'll fight back through this wind. It's already up, it's still up to 20 knots, I reckon. It was supposed to be like five, six knots for at least another couple of hours. So it makes it kind of hard fighting big fish when the wind's 20 knots. Well, that wind's backed right off. I had a had an inkling that would happen because it wasn't forecast. It just felt like a a weather system was just moving through, and yeah, I figured about half an hour to an hour it should be calm again which it is the <laughs> sun's out again oh it's beautiful out here again just need the uh the fish to come on the chew that sun out might help a little bit it might add a little bit of sparkle to the to the uh the skirts still early i've only been out an hour and a half so no rush to get home. Okay. Oh, I lost it. Lost it. Damn it. Okay. Okay. Hopefully this guy's hooked a bit better. Maybe another tuna. Not sure. He's still on though. Well, he doesn't feel very big. Doesn't feel very big at all. I haven't felt any bouncing yet, so hopefully a spotty rather than a tuna. Didn't go for a big run though, so hopefully it's not a shark. I can see colour. Decent size. What is it? that. Is it still on? Yep, it's still on. It's coming to water now, I think. Yep. Jeez, that was swimming fast towards me. quick. Oh, it's this guy again. He's pretty green. That's another spotty. Oh, this is a spotty. That one was a school for sure. Body. Oh, far out. All right. Oh. Oh. 
Okay, I've just put my last baits out. Um, it's been such a fun session. Often you go out and you paddle around for two or three hours, four hours, and you don't get a hit. Well, that's me anyway. So it's nice to actually get a few fish. Uh, got a spotty in the in the hatch. Got a, I think it's a school mackerel. Um, and got that tuna early on. So I've got two more baits left. I'm gonna paddle them around for a little bit and yeah, see if I can get one more spotty or Spanish or who knows. Um, maybe another half an hour and then I'll head in. It is stunning out here now. Absolutely stunning. This is what it was supposed to be forecast. It's almost a glass off. Fair paddle, I'm pretty knackered now. I was at 13 and a half Ks in three and a half hours.